let's talk for just a few moments about uh, some basic tips to help you go through this, this process of your first year of law school. First, budget your time. It's very important that you budget your time because your time is something that you will find extremely valuable. You will find is you'll, you'll, you won't have nearly the amount of time that you would like to have to do all the things that you need to do. You must budget your time for every single day and that includes your personal life as well as your academic life. Time is not only of the essence, time is money, time is grades, time is, is, is critical. So have a very un, un, good sense of how you're going to budget your time on a daily basis, on a weekly basis, and for your, throughout your first semester and your whole first year. Budget your money. It's very important that you, unless you're independently wealthy, you, you have an understanding of where you are financially understanding uh, where you need to be at different points of the time during the, the school year and budget your money accordingly. Uh, organize your life by organizing your relationships as well as your academic life and that's very important because organization is, is key. It's important that you under, have the people who are close to you, your family, your friends, with whom you have relationships, that that you have them understand that this is a, a, a very important time in your life, it's a very critical part of your life, and they will work with you. They, in most cases, they'll be proud that you're going to law school, they'll be happy that you're, you're there. In most cases, they'll want you to succeed. What your job is to do is to help them understand that this is not normal life. This is, this is something that's, that's far from normal life. Law school is a, is a whole different experience. It requires the kinds of sacrifices of time and, and resources that most people normally don't put up with on, on, on a normal basis. But law, that, that's what's required of law school and it's very important that they understand that, that you understand that, and that there's this organization uh, so that you, you can achieve a, a good balance. Now, the other thing, another thing you want to do is make yourself comfortable, as, as comfortable as you can, and, and that's in terms of what you're doing with your, the rest of your life, uh, the, your, your, the other things in your life, as well as, as in law school. You want, to, you want to live someplace, be someplace where you're not distracted. You want to be someplace where you can study, and you also want to be someplace where you can map out whatever transportation needs you have, whatever... Uh, culinary needs you may have, something that's comfortable so that you, you're not wasting time being distracted by the, the things of, of, of normal day-to-day -day life. One important tip, don't be afraid of law school. If you've been accepted to law school, you're probably good enough to graduate. Don't be fearful. Don't let the, the entire process intimidate you. Understand that you, you, you're, you're, you're smart enough to have gotten out of college. You're probably smart enough to get out of law school. So don't fear it. Just understand that it's a, it's a challenge. It's something that you have to work through, and you'll probably be okay. On the other hand, don't have a lot of hubris. Don't have a lot of arrogance. Don't think that you know this is this is you are the, the something that no law school has ever seen before, and you're going to show your professors what the law is all about. Don't be so arrogant and so egotistical that you think that your, your personality is going to get you through because that is not what law school is about. Many people think that you, you can look at a, 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 a lawyer on a, on a television program or a, a lawyer in a movie and get a sense from this person, uh, whether they're sharp or whether they're dimwit, as to what it takes to get to uh, graduation day in law school. That's not true. That's not true at all. What you have to do is understand that you are in a process that a lot of people have gone through before you. And they've seen the smartest minds in the world in, in, in law schools. And they've also seen some, you know, not too bright bulbs. But in most cases, you'll fit somewhere in the middle. So don't think that, that you're going to be, you know, the star of the show, that, 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 that it's all going to come easy because you're thinking that you're probably not going to do, be, be very successful. Which uh, brings a, a, another uh, concept of, of being somewhat humble, because law school can be a humbling experience. Understand, you're here to learn. You're you're on the you're on the campus to learn a great deal of information, a great deal of knowledge, a, a, a great deal of the law, and it's 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 it's, it's truly humbling to, to put it in perspective, because you're being asked to protect. 
participate in a long, ongoing process of, of this country and, and, and judiciary around the world of, of practicing the law. It's, it's a noble profession. Uh, it's an important profession. Uh, most societies cannot succeed without it. And your participation of the, in, in this process should be a humbling experience. Uh, so I, I would caution you to, to have a, a certain amount of humility when you're in law school. Make friends. Making friends can be a very important factor in success in law school because it helps you in many ways. It helps you to get information about what's going on. It helps you to, to study. It helps you to uh, bounce ideas off other people. It, it, it helps you in, in your private life. Uh, some of your friends may not be lawyers. Some of your friends may be, you know, uh, people who are not even in college. Uh, it's important that you find a balance, particularly uh, in law school, uh, among your peers and to be able to communicate with people because you'll find that it's not only a, a, an important process in law school, it's a, an important process to learn for the rest of your life when you're practicing the law. How to get along with people, how to, how to understand that you're, you're participating in something together and you're working towards a common goal. Put in the time. I can't stress that enough. You must put in the time. You have to avoid the distractions, and you're going to find yourself there will be a lot of distractions. I was uh, at the University of Michigan, and, and I was uh, often uh, distracted by the sport activities there. You, you will find that on your campus you have maybe football teams or basketball teams that are doing pretty well, and you want to go out there and you want to see the big game. Uh, sometimes you can do that, sometimes you can't. Now, what I did in my situation was I was I, I, I'm a sports fan. I love the team. You know, we, 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 were, we at that time had some, some great football teams, some great basketball teams. And what I did was I put in the time. I made sure that I put in all the time I needed to study so that when I went to the big house, 104,000 of my closest friends, and watched those games, I knew that I had done all that I needed to do for that week to study. I never went to Christ the Dream without knowing that all the studying I had to do for that week was completely to a movie, don't watch a television show, don't go on the internet, don't do anything that in any way detracts from your study because your studying is the most important thing that you